Hi there, welcome to GJB DIY. I'm Sarah, thanks so much for joining me today. Today I am here to talk to you about a fun new tool that I've added to my craft room. It's called the Artur Laser Master 3 10 watt diode laser. I've been having so much fun creating projects using this laser and I'm gonna tell you all about it and I'm gonna show you ways that you can make money using a laser like this. It's really fun, and as you can see, I have created so many fun projects. So let's get started on the video. First of all, let's talk about the sleek and lightweight design of this laser. It is made from super high quality materials, but they're super lightweight. And as a matter of fact, I'll be able to store this on my wall out of the way until I'm ready to use it, which if you are a crafter and have a craft room, you may understand that you need all the space you can get to accommodate all of your crafting tools. This is a nice aluminum frame. It was super easy to put together. I put it together myself in just, you know, 20 or 30 minutes. And it was super easy to get started on cutting and creating with this laser. So the program I'm using with my laser is the Light Burn program. It's a paid program. However, I'm using the 30 day free trial to see if I like it or not. Um, there also is the Laser Gerbil program, which is a free program um, and you can use either one and they're both fairly simple to use. There are more features obviously with a paid program than with a free program, but um, you could definitely test out both of them without having to spend the money up front to decide which one you would like. And there's lots of tutorials on both programs uh, for how to use it and create projects with it. So I am doing a cutout and engrave on this project that you see right here. It was very easy to set up in the Lightburn program. I was able to set it up and this only took about five minutes total to completely engrave and cut out. And once I was finished, I had a beautiful set of keychains that would be amazing for a gift or you could make these for a wedding, favors, whatever you'd like to do. I'm using one eighth inch basswood that I picked up off of Amazon for this project. And look how beautiful these turned out. What a fun uh, idea to create wedding favors for people. Huge money maker. People are always looking for great economical gifts to give out as wedding favors. And I don't think you can beat a super adorable keychain set like this. So you could have uh, the date and the place of the wedding, the couple, whatever you want to put on there. Or if you just want to do like I did, that's mine, my husband's names with our wedding anniversary in the date. But these are just so fun and beautiful and turned out wonderful. The really cool thing about this laser is that you can do all kinds of different projects on all kinds of different materials. Here I am working with some slate coasters that I picked up from Michaels. I plugged in the information into my light burn program and here it is engraving these coasters. These are so easy and so quick and you can customize them for gifts, for weddings, um, you know, like super easy project to make and sell at craft fairs. You could customize them to your local schools and businesses, and you could probably make a ton of money very easily with this product. So this laser boasts that it is the first of its kind to truly engrave a black and white photo at the fast speed of 20,000 millimeters per minute, which is insanely fast. Um, and that will cut your crafting or product making time down significantly. And I was really surprised at how fast my projects that I created were coming out. This is truly a very well-built, well thought out laser and 
Um, I know that there are more powerful lasers out there, but for the hobbyist or for a person who is wanting to to maybe open up their craft world or start a small business and they want to get started easily, quickly, and cheaply, um, cheaply comparative to some of the other lasers, this is a perfect product because it truly is super easy to use and it is very quick and I have, have been having, like I said, so much fun creating projects and I, my mind is just going crazy about all the things that I can create for Christmas presents this year. Like I'm making everybody Christmas presents and I am so excited to get to designing some of those projects. Well, like I mentioned before, the slate coasters are probably the easiest project to get started with a laser on. I'm guessing, I don't know personally, but it was very easy for me to get started with this project. And look at how beautiful this is. Like, who wouldn't want a beautiful coaster like this in their house? And think of all the designs that you could do. I mean, the possibilities are literally endless. You could add a sports theme or a business, you know, name, you could give these out as gifts if you were a business owner and you wanted to give, you know, a little gift to somebody. You could customize these any way to fit any decor or any theme. Now our tour also makes the roller engraver so this gives you the capability to engrave round objects like glasses wine glasses tumblers coffee cups or as you can see here rolling pins you have a lot of option availability and again this roller was pretty easy to put together and fairly easy to set up in my program and I was able to engrave this easily. You'll just need to be able to um, lift your laser up. And as you can see, I am just using cans of corn. <laughs> we feed our chickens corn, and I had those cans sitting out in my garage, and they actually worked perfectly. So if you end up getting the roller and the laser, think about grabbing some cans of corn too, so that you can lift your laser up. But this project was super easy, super simple, and the roller worked great. I didn't have any issues with the project. And look how cute this is. Grandma's bakery with a little gingerbread man in it. What a wonderful gift to give grandma on Christmas. So I'll walk you through a couple other projects that I created. This is a keychain, and all of the projects that I made today i got laser cut files from creative fabrica if you've never joined creative fabrica before you can click my link down below and you can get um, some free trial of it and then after that it is just 19 dollars a month for unlimited access to all of the products and um, services that creative fabrica offers and I love it. I do pay that $19 a month. I don't get it for free, um, but I do pay for it every single month. And I think that it is completely worth that $19. Now, if you do sign up under my link, I do get a small kickback or commission um, for your sign up, but I still pay majority of that $19 out of my pocket and I just really feel like it is worth it. So I'll leave that link down below along with all the links for the Ortour products um, and for um, any coupon codes that go along with this product. So as you can see, I used some paint to paint in my keychain here and I chose to do blue. My daughter's team has blue, and then of course the soccer ball. She is a soccer girl, and so I thought, let's do her team colors, and now I'm just gonna add a jump ring to the top circle there of the keychain. 
And now I'm going to add some chain so that my keychain will dangle nicely on my key ring. And I'll just cut those with some regular wire nippers. And then I will add a keychain um, or a key ring to the top of everything. And then these will look so nice on my keys and um, help me show support for my daughter and her soccer team. Again, think of all the customization that you could do with a simple key ring like this. And people love customization. Like, I think a lot of people, when they go to Etsy or to um, some other platform like Etsy to buy gifts for people, they want to be able to personalize them. And you're going to give them the opportunity to personalize the products that they want to buy for their loved ones. So this is a perfect way to do that. And here are a couple other keychains that I made. This one has got a football in the place of the O. This one says soccer mom, but then the mom has got all the, the little soccer um, ball. You know, it's got the soccer ball pattern. And then this one says senior 2022. Although my freshman daughter, you know, was like 2022. Mom, they're going to be 2023s this next year. And I was like, oh, yeah, I am completely out of it. I don't even know what year it is. <laughs> And so now this project here are some cow earrings that I found. I found these again on Creative Fabrica and I absolutely loved them. I thought, how adorable are these cow earrings? So I cut them out. And the fun thing about this project is you're getting like two earrings for one here because that middle cutout of your cow can be a stud style earring so you can paint that middle portion to look like a cow head put them on some posts and now you've got two earrings for one cut and again these didn't take any time at all for the laser to engrave and cut and i am just going to give these a nice coat of white paint first I did sand everything down pretty good with some heavy grit sandpaper uh, just to get any of those charcoal marks off. Now be aware that because it is a laser engraver and it is burning the wood that you might get some brown tinge here and there. But after I painted in those little black spots, look how cute these are. My oldest daughter is in love with them and has already claimed them for her own. So here I'm going to give you a couple ideas for some other projects. This is a bamboo cutting board from the Dollar Tree. I just did a laser engrave on this and what a beautiful piece of home decor could be displayed anywhere in your home. And then also I was thinking, well, we engrave wine glasses or beer glasses. Let's see if we can engrave a casserole dish because I know sometimes we take casserole dishes over to loved ones houses and then we end up leaving it there and we want to be able to have our name on it so why not and it worked wonderful look at this engraving made with love by Sarah everyone's gonna know that this is my casserole dish and it engraved the back side of it. I just did a flip of all the words so that it would come through the right way when you're looking down at the casserole dish. But how beautiful is that? Also, Christmas ornaments are a fantastic idea for, for craft fairs. And think of all the possibilities with these as well. You can make any kind of design. There are so many different templates out there, so many different ideas, and you could really go wild with ornaments. So I hope you are inspired by these ideas made from the Laser Master 3 by Ortour. And honestly, guys, it is such a great value for the price. And I think it would be pretty easy to make back your investment with this product, selling these beautiful handcrafted, personalized and amazing gifts that anybody would want in their home. 
So if you liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and check out my description box down below for all of the links um, in this video along with any of the products I used. I hope you have a happy, healthy, and blessed day. Bye!